Okay, in this part, you learned how to read the text and make sure your text, your reader has successfully connected to PC. If success, successfully connected, a read information will show here. If not, it is all blank. Okay, so the text reading tests are here and this part. So in this part, I will show you how to read the text. So just make a simple demonstration. Okay, firstly, put UH of text onto the readers and then click query tag. See that? In this part, you will see and you will find the EPC number here and you can just store, just click here and now you can see that this is the text by reading and it's really all the EPC numbers here and you can just check that one, check it has 4, 8, 12, 16, 20 24 okay 24 hacks here you can just check uh, 24 hacks here so this if you click this tag you read the EPCs and you can also read the TID just click here and just a query click query and it also can read the TID here so the TID has has its starting address and length. You can see that for this these two parameters, the first one is TID starting address, the second is TID length. And why I, I write the six? You know why I write this six? Because uh, because six means six length. Length six means. Uh, 6 40 bit means 90 90 bit means 24 hex yeah this is the relation between this uh, length and bit relation and hex relation so just keep in mind of this, and and you can all you can also uh, set in the standard adjust at zero two, uh, zero two, or zero one zero two, but length should be, mean no, it totally has six has ninety six length six bits, so length has to short it. Otherwise, you can't read so many. So you see. Length has been changed. So if I st still read 6 bits, uh, there may exist some error here because it's exceeding gas comma no check operatable. That means that uh, operation has some so some problems. So length need to be setting as put chief state sheet. So I just since my since my testing samples. Uh, NXP U code 8. So I just, uh, I can just check the code U code chip data sheet and refer to and check how how the EPC memory or TID memory is doing. Okay, just check check this one. Check this data sheet here. Okay. Okay, this is part. An I'll tag NXP U code eight. So it has actually has three different memory block. Uh, re respect our reserve memory containing access and claim password and EPC just uh, frequently used memory block. And then TID. TID is a tag unique 
unique numbers. It has just checked that is a 96 bit. So we just go to uh, this size means the length. So just re keep in mind, remember. And the starting adjust here, you need to find the detail memory memory map uh, here is U code 8 memory memory you can just see that and if you want to read the TIDs starting address and you can see that TID you find TID in now this EPC we go to TID part and this is the TID part so it's starting at 0, 0 hex and lenses and end at FH F Phi uh, F so from 0, 0 adjust hex or adjust hex hex to from to Phi from this adjust to to Phi it means that uh, totally you got six, six, sixty bits, and just and as this one, so we can take it sixty lens. So if I query, I query six lens, it means I read all the TID numbers here. You can see that is, uh, and this part is detailed uh, definition. Of TIDs, so uh, we can also read the text here. Okay, just here. I just need query tag. Okay, we can also read tag as its places. You can see that EPC password TID user. So I can operate in here, but first you need to choose the tag reading in the list. So I just choose one. And I starting adjust from zero zero, and lens. I just uh, lens of six. Okay. I just read. You see, the same as above, right? Okay. If I just read EPC, also use the cell operations, and for example, but I need to know the EPCs memory adjust first you can see that this is EPC memory the first 00H to uh, 1FH uh, uh, first one is CLC this is CLC uh, CLC check and uh, just one has some different uh, operation. The EPC lens, a UI X in indicator, number system indicator. Some of the uh, this adjust normally adjust zero zero and adjust one zero. We do not encode it at all. So we mainly operate it at twenty H to um, I to six F. So just choose this tag. For example, I choose this. Uh, so we're starting reading tag from 0 to and the length. Okay, length. Length to 20H to 9F. It means we totally got uh, 8 length. Means 100. And 28 bit. Okay, so I can just uh, input here as 8 and reading that here, you see 1 to 0. This is additional 8 bits and not display here. Okay, and also can read the password. And password, let me check password. Password should be this one, starting address from 0 
zero zero h two 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 three f. So I can just read the tag here from adjust zero zero to a length and it's four. Totally four, so I can just read this one. So a default killing password and access pass password are both eight F. Okay. Uh, so this is the reading and uh, is reading process. So just to, uh, thank you for watching. Okay. In that part, we will uh, teach you how to write the text.